so we'll kick back for the rest of the evening and just uh, do some Animal Crossing. If you're watching this later on YouTube, thanks for clicking as always. Uh, yeah, before this started, because, uh, you know, I opened the DS and set up the capture, Isabel said the fishing tournament is on, so there's a fishing tournament on. That's about all you've missed. Uh, yeah. Alright, which means we gotta... Oh yeah, wait a minute. I have a house now! <laughs> I forgot. I have a house now. Oh, it's... What? But this is the same... This is the same size as the tent. Okay. Sorry to intrude, Mayor. I see your house is all finished. Uh, congratulations. The lumber smell from a new house is so nice, isn't it? That reminds me, I brought over some wallpaper to celebrate your new home. Here you go. The paw print wall I just gave you is now in your pockets. Select it and choose hang on wall to change the room's wallpaper. You should try it when you get a chance. I hope you like the design. You can change your carpet as well by choosing spread on floor from your carpet, uh, from your pockets, geez. I hope you have fun redecorating your walls and floors with all the great designs out there. Oh dear, I forgot. There's actually something else I need to tell you. When inside your house, you can press up or oh, D-pad to change the camera angle in the room. You can also use it to zoom and change the point of view. Did you already know that? Oh, and if you press the switch on the lower screen, you can make the entire room lighter or darker. Okay. Since it's your home, you should take your time to enjoy it from each and every angle. Well, I'll be going now. Thanks for having me. Oh, yeah. And then we got, like, the light switch on the wall. It's not doing anything. Oh, no, it's very subtle, but I guess because it's daytime. Lights off. Okay, so... Hang on, what? No. Wrong option. I, I was using my thumb. Ah! Okay, let me get the stylus. I, I was being lazy. <laughs> <laughs> Let me get the stylus. I'm so weirded out by the time. I should have maybe made it like 12 hours. Oh, that's the wall. That's the wallpaper. You know, it's not going to be as featured as New Horizons, but that's fine. Display. Okay. There we go. So yeah, there's a there's a fishing thing. You also gotta look for fossils, you know, the daily stuff. Oh, these are different. They're like what is that color? It's like green. Oh yeah, and we'll go check if there's like any new tools on sale. I gotta say, I am enjoying the tools not being something that breaks. Like it's, it's kind of refreshing. I wonder why they chose to go with tools that break. I guess maybe it's just... It gives you more to do. If your tools are breaking, that means you gotta, like... Keep up to date with it and make sure that, uh... Yeah, you just get resources to build more. I like trying to concentrate right now, okay? Okay. Okay. Um, let's not fish just yet, because there's, there's a contest on. 
We gotta find, uh, yeah. Where are you? Everyone's fishing. Is this house new? Static's house. No, this is a new resident. So you don't get a choice here, this is just... Oh. Say what? Do you live in this town? That was not the voice I was expecting from this uh, squirrel. Ha, huh, and your name's Will. Well, I'm Static. I just moved here today. Yep, I'm the new guy. I might ask a favor or two now and then, but thanks for... Thanks for the advance for your help. I think it's just a zapping sound. <laughs> Sometimes just the word that they want me to say at the end of the sentence. I don't know how they want it to sound. I think this is meant to be like an animal sound. Oh, oh wow, do you look different. Unless this is a different character. No, it's Chip, okay. No wait, is it, is it the same one? I can't remember the name. Anyway, welcome, welcome. Welcome. First fishing tourney, right? For this month's tourney, any kind of fish will do, really. Whoever catches the biggest fish is the winner. When you catch fish, bring it to me and I'll measure it for you. Every time you break a first place record, I'll give you something good. Try our best to get first place. I'm accepting entries till 6pm. If you're in the top three at 6pm, you'll be in the awards ceremony. Fish, 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 and fish while you're at it. Bring me all the fish you can. Yuck, yuck. Oh, I should let you know. Fish you give me are not returned. Nope, keep that in mind. Well, good luck. Try and catch a nice, big, juicy one. I feel like... Looks a lot like, uh, Goofy. You know? Like I was expecting a... a in there at some point. Okay, but before before we get started, let me Let's see what's in here today. Welcome, welcome, come on in. A net, nothing new. Bowling pins. Okay. Yeah, there's nothing new. So, I still can't... I still can't use a slingshot <laughs> to get presents. Ah... <laughs> uh... There's, there's no medicine either, like, is my face just gonna- no, hang on. Like, maybe it automatically heals after a while. Remove accessory. Oh no, I'm back to normal. Okay, so you automatically get cured. Okay, I'm back to normal. Alright, we don't have to wear the, the mask and hide our hideous face anymore. But they did mention medicine. Donated. 
Okay. I mean, there was more to get, but I figured do it while we're here. Yeah, so that's interesting. I mean, villagers just moving in. So I guess I don't get to choose. It's just we end up with who we end up. All right, just pop in here to say hi to uh, the other able sister that's shy. Mabel, can you take care of this customer here? Yeah, that's that's it. I'm just saying hi. It does take a while for for the other sister to warm up. We'll get there. Okay, let's get to this fishing contest. Uh, let me check what the dailies, dailies are. Try selling an unwanted item, selling it retail. A lucky item, that is. Where today's lucky item? Lucky item? What's, how do I find out what the, what the lucky item is? Hmm. I'm not sure what a lucky item is. I mean, I'll take him a little one to begin with. What? <laughs> it just vanished? I scared it right away? Okay. But I mean, if I want to get big fish, the ocean would be the place to go. Wait, is this a weed? Oh, it is too. They look so different in this game. Oh, you don't get them. Okay. I mean, I would imagine there's one more. I think I just destroyed a snowball by accident. Oops. Oh no, there's another one here. I'm just glad my face is back to normal. I thought I was going to be stuck that way forever. prepared when it's a first, uh... Hang on. There's another one. It's so much harder as well because there's no rumble on this. Okay. I'm just gonna take it right away because... said every time I broke a record, I would get something, so... What? <laughs> what did I trip over? Huh? 
<laughs> Why did I trip over? Oh, it's my official friend. Catch something for me yet? Once you measure... So... Measuring it. That's all you do. You don't... You measure it and then you keep it. I already know the measurement of it, but sure. Okay, a dab, right? Let's take a look here. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Looks to be 15.65 inches. It's a new record. Right now you're in first place. That's a good place to be, don't you think? Dabs are really versatile snack fish. Stewed, grilled, fried. All good, but sashimi is easily the best. Of course, I'm perfectly happy to just swallow them whole. It's my nature, you know? Oh, this dab is delicious. Oh, that's right. Let me give you some bowling pins in honor of your record. Now, now it makes sense. Now, now it makes sense. This is a ruse. Post sufficient competition and then probably gives things that are like worth only a couple dollars just to get some fish. I, I see it. I see past his scheme. Uh, okay. I mean, let me just. I'll store them for now as I don't know if they're gonna come in handy. Oh wait, sell something in retail. Bowling pins, what was this? Wagon wheel? Uh, maybe not yet. Keep that on me. Alright. Almost destroyed the flowers. Good morning. Oh, I just love saying that. Good morning. Oh, uh, so what's going on, Cannoli? Hey, have you checked out the bulletin board yet? I haven't looked at it today, so I don't know what's going on, but you read it, right? Uh, bulletin board? I gotcha. You haven't seen it yet? Go check out the big bulletin board in front of the town's train station. Got the latest on town events and other cool news. Anyone can add messages and leave a note. One time when I passed by the board, I saw this super cute bird sitting up top. Super cute things totally catch my attention, so I take a co closer look, Cannoli. It turns out that whenever there's a new note, that little bird appears. Totally mysterious, right? Next time you pass by the bulletin board, you should see if that bird is there, Will. I'm not sure how I feel about being called a cannoli. Oh, yeah, there you go. Yep. Alright, so it's just that. It can only hold four? Oh, no, wait. No, I see. That's just how many there are. Okay. I was gonna say. <laughs> a fairly limited bulletin board. Carry on. Wake up, Blevins! Assess...
Fingers crossed. I mean, at this point, it should be mostly new. Hmm. I wonder if that means both of them are, or let's just see. Make a donation. Ah, wow, we've already got a duplicate. I guess I'll, this is the thing I'm going to sell. I mean, I'd be reading this, but it's not, it's not like New Horizons where we get facts every time. I do miss that a little. Is there anything here? No. Just having a little explore, seeing if there's anything else to see around here. What's this? It's just a sign. I'm not gonna mess with the trees today. <laughs> I just got my face fixed up. I think I'm good. We'll focus on the fish. I think the beach fishing is the way to go, because the river one seems to be small. So we're trying to beat 15.5 inches. I mean, I'll still catch to sell. Fourteen point three five, okay. Not quite. Oh, that's a big one. What? <laughs> what do you mean? What? What? Huh? That should have worked. <sighs> this is so much harder. I missed. I missed the rumble. Nice. This is a big one. 37 inches. All right, all right, all right. There's a new record. I'm going back. Hello, Will. Nice day to get a few things done, isn't it? Was there something you wanted? <laughs> I've been holding back a big tip until I was certain you're the kind of person I could trust. That is, trust not to take pictures of me when I'm not looking. What? Now I know you won't do that. What do you mean take pictures of you when you're not looking? Press and hold L to get your camera ready, then press R to snap the picture. Oh, yeah, no, I'm good. So since I told you the secret, never take a picture of me unless I'm looking my best, okay? You're a strange little penguin. Wait, is- oh. Are you melting? Only a well-made snowman can give away bingo cards. In my next life, I wish to be crafted- I wish to be better crafted so I can be a real gentleman and hand out cards to everyone. <laughs> I did my best! I thought you looked fine. 
I'm from Australia. We don't have snow. I've... Chat, I've never built a snowman in my life. Wait a minute. No, I have. Lies, I have. Once. But, like, there wasn't a real one. It was just, like... I feel like we had to go to many lengths. Can I shove twigs in his body for arms? Mm, I mean, I haven't found a twig in this game, so... I did build a snowman as a kid, but, like... It wasn't impressive, it was just... It, it would not be to the same extent of this one, let's put it that way. Like, even though this one's kind of dilapidated, it's still more impressive than what I built as a kid. But I, I will still say it, I don't think- I don't think I've ever built a snowman, really. Where- oh right, it's in the town center. It's here. Yeah, you set up a tent, there you go. See, you're such a liar, you say you want- you say that, uh, you're gonna measure it, but then you eat it. This one. New record. Even if the, they're pretty good if you don't do anything to them. <laughs> the sea bass is delicious. It's. When you think about this, how rude is this, right? It says, hey, let me measure your fish. And then just eats your- proceeds to eat your fish that you worked hard for and then burps in your face. Like, how rude is this? A blue chair. Okay. I mean, I suppose we get an item, but like, still. Every time I see one of these balloons, I'm so sad. You're sure some people are into it? Oh, no. I mean, you're not wrong, like... A universal truth, especially when it comes to the internet, is like, there's fetish for everything, and probably porn for that fetish. Like, the world is a strange place. Come here. I couldn't catch it. What am I tripping over? Or is this just what happens on the sand? It's as if there are rules to the internet. <laughs> well, I mean, there are people that try to make rules for the internet. I wonder if, like, a burp fetish would be on the same... on the same kind of line as a food fetish. Like, maybe the way that burp fetishes work... is that, you know, they get you to eat a particular kind of food and then you burp. So then it has, like, a particular smell to it. I would imagine it gets as nuanced as that. Stop. <laughs> you started it. I'm just finishing it. I was gonna go one step further with the joke, but you know what? I won't. It's fine. But if you use your imagination, you can probably imagine what I was gonna say. Ha <laughs> 
Okay, but like, I'm laughing because I thought of something. 19 inches, not, not. Somewhere out there, there's a person that has gone through every episode of Rick and Morty and has cut out every time that Rick talks and just put it into a compilation video because they find Rick's burp so hot. <laughs> I may have ruined the show for someone now. Oh uh, dear. You've never seen it? Okay, that's fine. There's a main character that just... Every time he talks, he burps. Well, I guess not every time. It's just like a... It's like a quirk. But fine, alright, let... let Let's, uh, let's see. Um, someone's gone through The Simpsons and cut out every time Barney Gumble burps. How about that? Is that more universal? It's like, oh yes! Burp. Listen to that sound of that glorious burp. Oh my god. What ferocity. You can really feel the garlic behind that burp. Oh my god, yes. Uh, 37? I, did that beat it? I think it did. Didn't they do that in The Simpsons? What? A burp fetish? Burp compilation. Oh, probably. I mean, they did have a clip show thing where they just, every now and then, would just take moments from the show and replay them. I'm pretty sure that was probably a Barney one. But I'm talking about, like, we're talking about almost 30, is it 30 years? I think it's, it's, it's quite a bit. No, it's more. How old is The Simpsons? I don't even know if it's- if that show's still going. Let me see. Right, so 34 seasons <laughs> worth of burps. Jeez. That- is it still going? Seven hundred and forty episodes. I can't believe that show's- it's still going. Wow. Yeah, well, there you go, the more you know. Not a new record, okay. Oh, it's still 37. He's still gonna eat it. Didn't know that either. Yeah, I mean, honestly, I haven't watched The Simpsons in a very long time. I think the last time I kind of paid attention to it was when the movie came out. Bart is still 10. Yeah, I know, right? You remember when you were younger than Bart? <laughs> it was old. <laughs> yeah. Oh, got it.
Yeah, I mean, at a certain point, I, I guess I just didn't find the show funny anymore. But I mean, I know that it, it's kind of had writers go come and go, so... You know what, what I heard someone say, um... Recently? So, you know, the equivalent of The Simpsons for, I guess, younger kids now is basically Spongebob. It's like... People will be able to quote Spongebob episodes. Much like I have the nostalgia for Simpsons, like someone that's younger than me probably has that same nostalgia for Spongebob and treats it in the same vein. Isn't Spongebob a kid thing? Uh, I mean... Most cartoons that are like during prime time. I guess it depends when you air it. But... It can be watched by adults. I, I watched Spongebob a few times when I was a teenager. It's one of those things that can be watched by anyone. It's... it's... alright. It's not a show for... that's designed for, say, children that haven't entered school yet. Let's put it that way. Spongebob is pretty old now, too. Yeah, it is. It's... that show's like 20-something years old. Probably closer to 30. When did Spongebob start? Hang on. No, it can't be. 1999. Alright, so yeah, it's like... Yeah. 1999. So, it's over 20 years old. It's approaching 25. Alright, there you go. Soonish. Next year sometime. Is such an ugly fish. Olive flounder. Okay, 34. It has to be more than 37. I mean, given that uh, it doesn't seem like... It seems like 37 is on like the higher end of uh, fish in terms of size. So bad at this. But I mean, the same thing happened in New Horizons. Like, I lost my mind fishing. Ah! <laughs> 37 inches is pretty big. How is that in uh, normal units? I mean, I could probably work it out. Yeah, I don't. I don't want that one. I want. I want this one. Thirty-two. Oh, there's. It's deceiving because the shadow isn't really representative of how big it's going to be. Oh, I got you. Mid 94 centimeters. Ah, oh, okay. 35. Oh, the classic sea bass. Game. 
Can you please stop taunting me with these presents? Like, I don't have anything to get it. How many cool items have I missed? You're gonna say mid 90s and then left the word in. <laughs> yeah, because it's redundant, right? Like mid 94. But I mean, you could say it's like 94.5. It, it might still make sense. Kind of like how the British say, like, half 12 instead of 12.30. Go away. I, I, I want this big one. Okay. It's either 93 or 94. Well, I didn't know that. Could have just been like, yes, that's exactly what I was going for. Another sea bass. What, you again? Wow, this is this is self-aware. It knows what it's doing. Uh how am I for space? Alright, three more. Maybe the shadows are deceiving. Let's test. Yeah, okay. So I should only be going for the big shadows. I'm gonna see if there's any large ones in the river, because it's still possible. It's just the ocean seems more likely. What am I tripping over? <laughs> this isn't funny. Is my character just a klutz? Hey, Mama Bear, how's it going? Uh, it's going well. Just was playing a bunch of different games, uh, checking out all the demos that are part of Next Fest. Well, a selection of them anyway. And now just wrapping the evening up with a bit of this. There's a fishing contest, so I'm trying to make sure I have the largest fish before the day wraps up. Hello, Will. You seem chipper as always. So how can I help you? What's the latest? Listen to this, I have a terrible, scary, true story to tell. Not long ago, I was so tired that I accidentally fell asleep without saving. When I woke up, I didn't remember a thing from the day before. It was like the whole day had been erased. I guess I'd learned my lesson. It's important to save. To do that, press start. Uh... After all, if we get the chance to play together, I don't want to forget how much fun this was. Please make sure you're extra careful about that. Okay, I haven't saved once, so... <laughs> Good to know. Only Brits say half 12. Well, that I've heard anyway. Australians say 12.30. And I think uh, New Zealanders do as well. Let me put it this way. As part of the glorious Commonwealth, I've only ever heard British people say like half 12. I, I don't think Americans do either. I mean, it might be worth finding out, but yeah, I've, I haven't heard it from anyone other than someone from the UK, so. Oh yeah, right, I was gonna go here. Hmm. 
Definitely not here, maybe Canada. I don't think Canada is either. Like, here it alternates between 12.30 or like half past 12. But we use the word past. Right? Like, it's half past 12. No one says half 12. So. I think for us it's kind of like influence from British and American, so we kind of like pick the middle ground. I think the most confusing thing about Australian lingo... So, you know... The British will say crisps for potato chips, right? And uh, chips will mean fries. In Australia, there's no distinction. But there's no confusion ever either, if you think about it. So, you know, chips for us can be a bag of potato chips, or it could be that you get some fries. But, like, based on the context of where you're going, it, you don't really ever need to explain yourself, right? It, it, I don't know. I don't know how it works, but yeah. We use the word chips for everything and no one's confused. <laughs> fish and fries. I don't think they call them fish and fries. I think it's still fish and chips. Because, uh... Yeah. Uh... My friend and moderator here, he lives in, uh, Washington, and sent a picture the other day of, like, the fish and chips he got, so... It looks nothing like, uh, what you get here. Here, it's, it's pretty comical just how many- how much chips you get when you go to one of those like they have a concept known as minimum chips which is like the smallest quantity you can buy and it's probably enough to feed a family of four to be honest <laughs> it's just it's so much that's why i rarely go to them it's just if i'm going there really i have to go there with like bare minimum one other person because it's just way too much food There's a, uh, there's a brand of, uh, potato chips that are from, where are they from? I think they're from England, but, like, they've recently started selling them in Australia, and on the back of the bag, they're, like, trying to advocate for everyone to call them crisps, and no one does. <laughs> like, there's an, I wish I had a bag to, I wish I had a bag to read it, but, like, yeah. They're like, these are, these are crisps. They're not chips. Oh, pardon me. Welcome to the Oh Yes Museum. Okay. Oh, I'm getting duplicates already? I've barely been playing this for three days. <laughs> well, I'm already getting fossil duplicates. That's two today as well. That's... That's pretty unlucky. I guess I'll put it up for sale. I'm not even sure what price I should try and sell it for. I just went with the, the recommended price, or whatever price popped up first. But I mean, I put my hive there and no one's bought it. Okay, so like... <laughs> what? 
Right. Vesta. Flip. Lucky. Okay. I mean, this is already a doggo that's that's injured. <laughs> ah, I'm being so mean. Why does that keep happening? Is it because I'm carrying something and I just lose my... My center of gravity, like, is that what it is? I'm gonna sell the other fish I got. every fish. I'll go put the fossil up for sale at retail. Alright, I have money again. Whose house is this? Oh, this is Anacotti. Okay, Anacotti just doesn't want to be with everyone else. Just decides to move as far away from them. And this is Frigga, okay. I mean, I, I can relate to that. Like, I, I've moved as far as humanly possible. I wish I had a bigger space. That mirror is kind of nice. Um, I'll solve this. I'll just go with the recommended <laughs> price. No one's bought my 500 bell hive. No one appreciates a good hive. Stop! My darling is extremely tired from working all night, so please let him get some sleep. He was working all night yesterday. Is this just a thing where if I'm persistent enough, he's just going to wake up? Or is this just something that's going to resolve itself eventually? Okay. I can't imagine anyone buying that high for 500 bells. Like, that, that's a ripoff. But I guess that store is much like your typical uh, second-hand shop in the inner city here. The amount of, like, shops there are that go further out into the suburbs to buy, like, old clothing or, uh, like, just second-hand stuff. Oh, that pun. And then they go into the city and kind of just label it as being vintage. Oh, man. Like, stuff they probably would have picked up for less than $10, and then they try to sell it for 60 
It's like, ah, oh, it's vintage. This t-shirt with like a faded pattern, that's, in that's intentional. It's not due to wear and tear, it's vintage. Oh, okay. I just wanted to make sure. Does anyone know if there's a way to be able to see if you've already donated the item to the museum? Because I know in New Horizons, the way you could tell... Uh, let me swap to this layout. Like, when you would go to it, there would be a stamp where you could see. But I haven't figured that out on this one yet. Like, it doesn't look like... It doesn't look like there's a way you can tell if you've donated it to the museum or not. Like, only that I've caught it. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know. I'm still not sure which layout is best to stick with. Because uh, this one, you can see what's going on on the bottom screen, but a lot of the time it's just the map. And then there's this one, or this one, which is like, this is just the top screen, full screen, pretty much. I think this one, because you can see both, and I guess if what's going on in the bottom screen is more prominent, then I'll swap, but... That's the problem with streaming DS games, is I don't know what layout to use. But I think this is fine. Yeah, what a bizarre color. Um, I don't have a watering can at all, so... I was gonna say, like, move the flowers. I don't think I'll start the- OH MY GOD, I FELL FOR MY OWN TRAP! This is like, Wily Coyote stuff. <laughs> I was like, oh, it's a fossil- In- in my defense, it is 1.30 in the morning. And so, if it appears like I have a smooth brain, it's- it's because I'm tired. But as Wario would say, it's like, Eh, what do you mean? Smooth brain means it's not used, it's in pristine condition. Yes! It's not wrinkled and old. So, you know. Yeah. I mean, I'll just keep catching... Okay, hang on. Oh. Playing New Leaf? Yep. Late night New Leaf. 42! Alright, that's a record. There we go. Get back to... Yeah. I'm gonna make sure no one beats this record. I still think- I still think this is so rude. Like, Chip says, I'm going to measure it. So you're like, okay, yeah, yeah, you can measure my fish. He does say you're not gonna get it back, but then... Measures it. And then just... Not only does he eat it, but then burps in your face. <laughs> That's the part I can't get over. There's this, he burps in your face.
It's a good game. I haven't played it before. This is my first playthrough of it. My first Animal Crossing game was New Horizons, so... Since I got a capture card for my DS, I figured I'd go back and check out this one. Because people have been telling me this one, whilst it doesn't have as much decoration and customization options, there's more to do. So, I don't know. Like, some people prefer New Leaf than New Horizons, so... I figured it was worth a look. I always find it wild just like how quickly it becomes. Oh, you've been playing for an hour. I feel like I just started and I've already been playing for an hour. Oh, I, was <laughs> I was going to catch that bug. I'm just never there at the right place at the right time. I was standing still. Why? It was funny, in, in New Horizons, like, within the first month I had caught the majority of the fish, and then the bugs. <laughs> I had caught, like, three. Because I, I was always running around town, and so the bugs would just get scared. Oh, man. Gotta look. All good, Mama. They're all good. Oh, no. Okay. But, see, the shadow isn't representative, I guess. This is probably just gonna be another sea bass. It's a sea bass. Thirty-nine, still not as big as the other one. I really miss the controller vibration because with that alone, I could tell like what kind of fish I had caught, and it made it easier. It's so self-aware. there's any fish. <laughs> keep falling over. I don't know if there's any fish that would be bigger than what's in the ocean. seen any large shadows in the river. Where is big fish?
What are you two doing? <laughs> Just running into each other. Uh, Will, you're looking kind of tired. Maybe it's time you took a rest. How do, how did this is the second time this how how do you know how late it is? It can't be based on the the time in game because I've set it to be eleven in the morning. How does this tiny mouse know that I'm up late? It's the second time this has happened. No one's going to judge you if you need to take a little break once in a while, Cannoli. I mean, maybe it's like a, you've been playing for an hour. Take a break, but... <sighs> I want it, but I can't get it. How do you know? Oh, okay. I mean, that looks medium, but... Mine's just a tire. Can I go feed that to Chip? I'll do a couple more laps, but if I don't see a big fish, I'm just going to go back to the ocean. <sighs> Why must you taunt me? I don't know if I've donated that one. I might check. It's not big enough anyway. Just ignore it. You know what I, I just realized? Do I need to be around at 6 p.m. to get this reward? Huh, because if I do, then there's not a whole lot of point to this fishing contest because I won't be here. Like, it's, it's late. Unless I change the time on the DS. Yeah, that kind of just occurred to me. What time is it in-game right now? 
six hours. Yeah, I mean... Okay, as long as I check it before the day ends. I don't have to change the clock, but... I might do that off stream and just see the results and then I'll update it next time. I'll just be like, yeah, this is what happened. I think that's a compromise. Ah, oh, damn it. <laughs> I hate it when they do that. Uh... At least this doesn't have the achievement that's in New Horizons, where you have to catch a hundred fish without failing. The amount of times that I messed it up on those kind of fish. Ugh. This is probably the worst time for me to do something that's based on reaction time. <laughs> it's past midnight. Uh... Oh. I wonder if that's going to bring bugs. I'll, I'll leave it. Alright. But I'm going to catch this one. Just in case it's, it's a large one. Stop doing that! Stop doing that. I got it though. 35, alright, no. Let it go. <laughs> I'm just gonna check that other one that I got has been donated. Yeah, that's probably not a big one. Looks like I'm up to date. All right. I'm not sure I'm gonna 100% this. <laughs> it's just... I guess I'll have to do like time zone adjustment. At some point, maybe I'll do a day where I play it at the real time it is for me right now. So then I can get night stuff, but for now. We'll stick to this. Let's just pretend I, I live in Europe. Oh wait. <laughs> I was gonna sell. Yep. There's the 1am brain right there. Uh, 
Okay, I say what Mr. Nook is uh, is offering. I haven't done that. Plunge myself further into debt. Why not? Welcome, welcome. Oh my goodness. It's Will. So good to see you, hmm? Your home has now been built, yes? What do you think? Your house is now the stuff of dreams, hmm? And now the numbers. I deducted your down payment, leaving a grand total of 39,800 bells. That's the total amount of your paltry little loan. I'm a trifle, yes? Hmm, oh no. You don't have to pay me directly. Please make all payments at the post office bell point. And there's no set schedule either. Pay the loan off at your own pace or whenever you're able to, hmm? Yes, yes, one more thing. We do require that all homeowners become members of the Happy Home Academy. Hmm? They'll just stop by from time to time and give your home an in-depth inspection. Very good to get one. The inspection is a comprehensive look at your room and furniture layout, your hygiene level, etc. You give, if you're given high marks, you might even receive a wonderfully elegant commemorative prize. They'll schedule the inspection, so there's nothing for you to worry about. No worries at all. Hmm? What else? Members, you see, also gain access to the HH showcase behind the shopping district. Once you've received a letter that confirms your membership, you may visit the showcase at any time. Very good. Please do come see me if you wish to discuss further re renovations. Hmm? This is a castle. That castle is an excellent example used for exterior aesthetic changes. Hmm? Make your house bigger, and then we can make large-scale renovations as well. Okay, so... Guess we just gotta pay off the loan. I mean... I'm not gonna rush it too much. I think one of the things I regret about New Horizons was, like, I... I admittedly went a bit overboard. <laughs> so I did stuff pretty quickly. But, the other thing was, you know, there was a pandemic, and, uh, yeah, that wasn't great. Especially since where I live, it was, like, the world's most locked down city. I feel like I only ever see <laughs> two fish. Ugh. Oh, you got a legend. Ah, see, it marks the houses. Okay. I don't know. I feel like the river's not going to give me anything that'll beat the record.
I should probably check <laughs> the list of available fish and then make an informed decision that way. What? Oh, well, okay. Just the time. Man. How does this go by so quickly? the beach. This feels like a fruitless endeavor. Only big fish. Oh, hold on. place at the right time. Turn around. I think I'm too impatient for this. <laughs> okay, there we go. Damn it. But it's my hope that after a few day days of this, I'll get the hang of it. It's just... The rumble was so nice. Huh. I just realized, what if there's an audio delay between... Well, because I'm not listening to the audio from the DS directly, like, it, it's going into my computer and then I'm listening to it through headphones. But then if I put the volume up on the DS, you'd be able to hear it through the microphone, so... I guess I just have to get used to it. Like, it won't be that much of a delay, but probably enough to, like, mess with the ones that have tight timing. I guess I have to go by image alone and not sound. Yeah, <laughs> it's, it's also late, so. Hey! Turn around. It's just getting further and further away. What are you doing, fish? Take my bait. There you go. I 
I don't think I'm going to do better than the one that I've caught. It's not that I, I don't think I'll find the bigger fish, it's just... I think my reactions are starting to get pretty shot. But what sucks about this is, like, I won't get the fish back if it's a big one and a unique one. What? <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> Take the bait! This must be frustrating to watch. Cammy, you're up late. How's it going? I was heavily focused on getting that fish. Girlfriend had a birthday at the pub, just got back 30 minutes ago. Nice. 40. I think the biggest one was 42. Okay, the way I can do this is like... Stop tripping over the first of all, but... Can I just... Okay, one of these fish is just gonna be like a sacrificial lamb. Forty-two. I can't see the size anymore. It was forty, so. Okay. Nothing in life or the universe or anything what is bigger. I have no frame of reference of how big like that is.
Because we don't use that unit here. Making a reference to a terrible movie in an entertaining book. Oh. The answer is 42, right. I know, I know what you're saying now. It's kind of funny because the answer was actually 42. It's a good job. God, that one's hard. Is it possible to clean the beach of all the junk? I put that junk there. If this is anything like uh, the other Animal Crossing game, I need to leave junk because it attracts bugs that I can catch. So I'm leaving it there for now. There's definitely a, a big fish out here. I just haven't been able to catch it. I just haven't been quick enough to the draw, which... I think it's just me being tired <laughs> at this point. Yeah, see, that one is very lenient. that gigantic shadow. You know, it just occurred to me that, like, this beaver is eating 42 inches of fish. Like, that's kind of insane. See if I can run into that big shadow again. Eh, it's probably just a dab. No big fish for me. I wanted to give it another go, but it's not appearing. I'm sure that one's gonna beat my record. I 
Maybe I just have to get rid of some of these. Okay, you can go. Give me new fish. I want no fish. New fish. A what? I was trying not to catch that and I guessed that it was like a first. That was a fluke. I wasn't trying to catch that. I just pressed the button to get rid of it and it caught it. I'm not that good of a fisherman. It insisted that it be caught. That is the big fish. Oh. It is the big fish. I don't know if, I think this is just a sea bass, yep. 47. That's a new, that's a new one. That's a record. Okay, uh, swap out the tire. Uh, I'm gonna try and get this one as well. Oh, I got it. Forty one. Let it go. Goodbye. I think it just occurred to me why he eats the fish. It's just to swap it in the inventory. So then they didn't have to account for the situation where you don't have space to receive the reward. No, but then he eats it anyway. I don't know. I just don't like the fact that he burps in my face. Rude. Oh. Okay, here's the problem now. Which one is it? You would think it's this one. Uh oh. Burp back to a certain dominance. <laughs> oh, this is annoying. I won't know which one's which. I'm gonna lose them all. I have a one in four chance that I get it right. There it is. All right, cool. How do you eat 47 inches of fish like that quickly? Marine pop floor. Interesting. Just consider how much that is in terms of weight, like... 47 inch fish. Just how, how much is that? How much that would be? Just eats it in a matter of seconds. Okay, let's see what this looks like. Oh. <laughs> I mean, I guess. Look at the look at the colors, chat. I mean, they they do kind of go together, but sure, why not? There is yellow on the floor. Okay, I need to go donate that bug. I mean, that's going to be pretty hard to beat. Mm. 
Oh yeah, I don't have to walk, I can run now because there's no bugs up here. Make a donation. I wish she had unique text for every single item. No, we're good. I do miss that. Sail the fish. Sell all the fish. not what I was trying to do. <laughs> it looks like I'm just doing lazy parkour. Okay, chat. As much as I would like to continue, it is late here. Very late. And I need to get some sleep, because I gotta get up tomorrow to go to a family thing, so... Not early early, but early enough that I can't stay up much longer. But, I do hope you enjoyed the stream today. It was fun again, checking out all those different games from uh, the Steam Next Fest demo. So, I'll continue that tomorrow. I, I think I got like four other game demos that I downloaded from that. So, we'll, uh, we'll do one more round of that tomorrow once I get home from the family thing I gotta go to. So I hope you'll join me for that, and afterwards we'll probably do more of this, just to kind of wrap up the evening as usual. But yeah, thanks you so much for watching, especially if you're new to the stream. I uh, hope you did enjoy yourself here. If you want to find me whilst I'm away, YouTube's the best place to go. Just search for the channel name over there, bunch of videos will pop up, whether they're past streams, highlights, or every now and then I'll go live on YouTube as well, so hope you do check that out. And uh, yeah, I'll be back tomorrow. And if you're watching the replay later on YouTube, thanks for clicking. And if you want to see more of this content, do the button pressing where you like type something and let me know. And also the picture of the hand with the thumb up. Yeah. English is hard at like two in the morning. <laughs> don't have to but it, it helps out the stream and also lets me know what people enjoy alright and on that note I'm gonna, I'm gonna go to bed thank you so much for watching and yeah I'll be back tomorrow at some point so hope to see you then <laughs>